Hey candy babes, welcome back to part two of green screen for the Lolo slash editing. In this particular video, I'm going to show you guys an in-depth tutorial on how I input my images or my video into my actual live video. So the first thing you want to do is make sure you have a folder over to the side here. Um, as you can see, I have a green screen edits folder where I pretty much have my media and all of the images that I wanted to play around with. Um, this makes it easier to access. So go ahead and grab one of the images that you downloaded or that you like and slap it into the media area. That's the first thing you want to do. Um, I have it scratched out here because you want it to be pretty much the length of the video so you'll see you can shorten it or make it less whatever you need to do um, go ahead and click on the crop to fill and you want to do this because you want to be able to get like a full background in your particular video that is now added to the reel let's go ahead and grab the media that we want to import and put that right directly on top of the image and again you want to stretch out what you have imported or what you've imported so that it can be full screen or it can go all the way through the video however you want it next you want to click on your reel and go up to picture in picture which is this button right here and it'll give you this particular uh, drop down menu and you want to click on blue green screen click that voila look at you <laughs> now I am in the middle of the beach somewhere um, what you'll notice is you'll see the side here where my actual house is showing and you want to get rid of that and the way to get rid of that is to basically um, pull your video in like so okay and we'll do the other side and voila there we go okay so now that you got that you'll see that you kind of have like a green halo around you um, you want to get rid of that or you can get rid of that and make it look even more cleaner by simply going around yourself and just highlighting and clicking to make sure that you delete some of the green out of it. Basically, you're doing a little color correcting and you're using, again, this little cleanup button here. You see the little eraser and you can notice the changes as I go along and you can see how it pretty much takes out some of that green outline on myself. Next, what you want to do is play around with your color. If you're not happy with it, um, I can do the auto adjust on myself or I can play around and do some uh, skin tone balance. Change me red, change me pink, whatever color you want to be, you can change yourself. Um, another thing you can use or another tool you can use is the uh, saturation and the uh, color contrast tool. And basically you can take it up, down, make it high or low and it basically adds more color or takes out color as needed whichever one you want to do um you can make it cool or warm whatever floats your boat whatever you like of course okay and there my friend you have a finished product simple easy one two three check me out <laughs> now you can change these images however you want all you have to do of course is split the clip and you can add in a totally different image um i'll show you guys how you can do that real quick basically i'm going to take another image and slap that baby right there and drag it out and look at that it'll change up just like that there you go look at that and again you can clean it up by using that same tool the cleanup tool and it doesn't matter how many images you add, you can add three, four, five, whatever you want to do, but you can just do you. <laughs> Make it really nice and really cool. Basically, um, if you like this video, you think it was cool, I hope it was helpful. And um, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. The main thing, as you guys can see, I need you to do me a favor and subscribe, please. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And I love you guys. And.
Peace out.